What's up everybody, I'm Sheed, welcome back to Become a Legend episode 4 and you probably noticed there was no storyline at the start of this episode and what I decided to do now that I, you've seen that I started my uh, FIFA Pro Career Mode as well I'm trying to maybe have uh, storylines kind of exclusive to that series maybe maybe I'll have the odd storyline um, here and there for Become a Legend just like I did last year for like celebrating the 50th episode or uh, you know occasions basically like that that are like special and that why they would require a storyline but otherwise I would like to keep the storytelling basically like let the gameplay do the storytelling just like I did last year basically not try to uh, make up a story myself but just let uh, whatever is going on in Cole's life basically that's what uh, that's exactly what relates to you but uh, uh, so yeah you know, people were yelling at me for copying A9 skills because he was uh, called Junior, my character. And uh, now that I started my FIFA Pro Career Mode, there uh, somebody said I'm copying A9 skills because I'm using Sims. So either way, I'm getting yelled at. Um, anyway, let's actually get into the gameplay because I won't be having storylines uh, every episode anymore. I'm actually maybe gonna do three ep matches per episode so that we don't, uh, so that it's like a uh, good length. But look at that Cole Jr. inside the box, shoots it, keeper saves it, but then again, second time around comes to Cole Jr. and he gets his first goal of the career, the first goal for Atletico Paranaense because it's not a training match, it will count for his career total. He has like uh, three assists maybe and one goal. And he's a striker, he's a center forward, which is not the good, the best um, record at right now, but you know it'll definitely improve in the future. And the, just a good, not, I was going to say it's a good goal, it's a, it's a, it's a second time round goal, it's a, def, uh, a rebound goal, that's, that's the word. So it's not the greatest, uh, you know, way to open the scoring, but look at that first touch, defender completely clueless, and that's why we get a goal. But yeah, if you guys like came back from last year from my Become a Legend last year, you know that I sometimes I didn't even talk about the gameplay at all. I kind of liked it to be a series where I just kind of uh, address my viewers or just tell you what's going on with me and my life with my channel. So that's why I kind of want to, to have Become a Legend like storyline free for the most part. Uh, Cole Jr. awful effort there, and he gets substituted. By the way, I'm starting to think that. Uh, when we get substituted, it's not even because of, it's not just because of low stamina. Uh, I think it uh, has to do with like position, like you remember in last year, um, it depended on the team 8 rating, by the way, for Cole Jr., which is awesome. Then the next match is Vasco da Gama. Anyway, I was saying that uh, sometimes, like, if you, it depends on your position. If you play, if you are only limited to one position and they change the formation, you will get substituted because you cannot adapt to the new formation. You cannot play a different position than, than um, your main one. But uh, having said all that, just as I was talking, uh, the very first opportunity of the Vasco da Gama match, Cole Jr. gets another assist. So um, he is a clinical striker, but not in the traditional way. He has a long shot there, cannot finish it. And then not like his daddy, though. Look at this opportunity, though. He is on the wing. Cole Jr. inside the box. A cross there, and Cole Jr. heads it in. You'll see in the replay, though, uh, that it uh, was a little deflected. That's why the keeper seemed so off it, because he was going to the original um, target that the ball was headed. Uh, headed. No pun intended, but the original, you know, trajectory of the ball. But uh, because of the defender there, he get he. Maybe Cole have, wouldn't even have gotten the goal if it wasn't for the deflection. Not the most uh, telling of replays, but you'll see it in just a little bit in this next one. There he is. He is crossing it. Cole Jr., though, really good positioning there. And there he, he, he you see there he headed it right in the face of that other player, so that's why it went in. And uh, two goals in this episode for Cole Jr., which is awesome uh, so far anyway. It's only half time. And the uh, 63 possession for Vasco da Gama. Something about every team we play against, they just seem to be dominating possession really well. And uh, it's good though, because we can hit them on the counter. Cole Jr. doesn't have the best pace, but as as long as you one to it effectively, you don't even necessarily need that much pace. They have a, quite a few shots there at the near post. Uh, they have another break here, and uh, Leonardo, or whatever that guy's name was, he just misses it. And then 67th minute, Cole Jr. gets substituted. And that's how it ends, 2-2-0. Two, two, one assist, one goal for Cole Jr., and that is a really good record right there. 
so yeah, that's uh, that's how I'm gonna keep it, um, at least for now. No storylines, maybe just for like special occasions. And uh, when uh, the if the episode is too short with two matches, I'm gonna include a, a third match like at this with this one. I hope you guys enjoy it. It's a uh, kind of a throwback to last year's Become Legend, and and uh, I know most of you come from uh, my old series anyway, so you probably enjoy this format. Uh, anyway, though, I've been Shade. Do leave it a like if you enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.